The media reports filed from Harrington spread various images of this town throughout the United States and around the world. The lasting impact this will have on the community remains to be seen, but it's clear that all the media attention has already had an effect. Finally tonight, Harrington, Kansas, a small town that became famous because of the Oklahoma City bombing. Elizabeth Farnsworth, a Kansas native, reports. Timothy McVeigh lived here part of the time he was stationed at Fort Riley. Terry Nichols moved here in March this year and, allegedly, used this house as a base of operations while assembling the materials for the bomb. When he walked into the local police station on April 21st, and then was taken into custody by federal marshals, Harrington hit the front page, and townspeople are still recovering from the shock. There have been some major stories unfold in Harrington uh, throughout its history, but uh, never of uh, this magnitude. The Harrington Dateline went around the world. I doubt if that had ever happened before. And in some cases, uh, some of the publicity we got was less than uh, acceptable, less than glamorous. Some of, the, some of the things said or some of the things shown portrayed us in a, a bad light. Uh, some of the leads on the, the newspaper articles that came out talked about uh, farmers standing in their mud cake boots. So there were times when we felt um, that we'd been held up to a little bit of ridicule simply because we are a small town. <laughs> 